Hi, I'm Uncle Bonian. Can we talk about hypocrites? I don't know if I'm a hypocrite or not. Um, I'm wanting to up my game on the YouTube and not just YouTube, but my content in general. I'm wanting to do more of the um, more daily content. I want to get more stuff out. Um, but I also want to put it on more platforms than just three speak and I, um, so that's why I'm putting this on YouTube as well. Uh, I'm probably still not going to put it on BitChute, and I'm obviously not going to put it on, on Odyssey because I do not like Odyssey. Hey, you're being a bully. Leave her alone. Sorry, my dog was bugging the cat. Um, not that the cat never instigates anything with the dog. <laughs> it's one of those things. You can see her getting into the window. I got the window open and she thinks that it's for her. So, anyways. Start that all over. One, two, three. I'm Uncle Bonehead. Can we talk about a hypocrite? So, I just want to know, am I a hypocrite? I've, I've been a long time supporter and, uh, I don't know, I guess you call it defluencer, for lack of a better term, um, on Twitter and, well, give you a little backstory if you look at the other my other youtube channel called uncle bonehead just uncle bonehead not real uncle bonehead um it was it's sporadic <laughs> to say the least so has this one this one's been sporadic to say the least uh, <laughs> for the last several years i started a podcast called the self-hosted podcast which was Originally, a way for me to learn self-hosting and using Why You Know Host as a the Why You Know Host dis, distro to self-host all of my stuff, and that ran for a good, you know, bigger part of a year. And then I, it clicked in my head that in order to be decentralized, the user needs to be decentralized as much as the apps are that they're using um so i went from the fediverse i jumped to um high social media i didn't technically leave the fediverse i just kind of wavered on it really badly and uh i ended up switching from mastodon.social to um friendica on social.trom.ff or tf and and it's a Frendica, their, their theme for Frendica is sweet. You've got to go check out social.trom.tf. Um, as far as Frendica instances go, they, I think they are the, the top notched when it comes to Frendica. Um, I really don't have a whole lot of people on Frendica. I did connect my Twitter account to that Frendica instance. And so now, you know, every tweet I make, it goes on to social dot social Trump. And, and it's, it's very cool. Trom dot TF, TF also has their own version of a distro. I believe it's Manjaro under the hood, but it's, it's really nice. Um, I haven't visited it for a while. I do know that they were working on maybe changing it up somehow, but I don't remember if they were going to keep it as arch or if they were going to switch it to something else. But I, I digress. I'll, we'll visit that sometime. Um, but as far as being a hypocrite, I I don't really think I'm being a hypocrite if I'm going to start putting my stuff on YouTube again. Um, if you've noticed, I've brought, dropped the mic back over here. I bought, I'm, I'm 
I'm doing a lot of stuff. My stuff will always be first and foremost on decentralized social media blockchain. Um, and the Fediverse. Those are my first two priorities when it comes to posting my content from now on. Um, the stuff on YouTube, I'm probably not going to stream on YouTube, but I will do streaming on them or maybe Twitch. I doubt Twitch because Twitch doesn't like the music stuff. But I've got... You didn't see that. I'm chewing. Yeah, I know. I'm not supposed to be. But anyways, I digress. I, I don't understand some other people. I, 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 I just don't, don't get it. I, I, you know, you see people like, uh, no crap. I can't remember what the Twitter is. It's a reclaim the net. They're big decentralized stuff, you know, posts and stuff. And yeah, they list Hive as being, you know, a good alternative social media. But then you see people, they, they, they post mostly about Getter and Rumble <laughs> and Odyssey. All those places that you could be banned from and deleted from. <laughs> It doesn't make sense. Now, I'm not saying, you know, I'm, I'm not on a crusade against Odyssey or Rumble or anything. But I am on the crusade of getting people to see that there is other alternatives out there. If you don't want to join them, fine. I don't care. That's up to you. But to continue to stay on these other platforms... And bitch about them day in and day out. You ain't doing very good. You ain't doing nothing good for yourself. Just get off of them. Go someplace else. In fact, the best thing you can do to open your eyes and see what the world is like. Shut off the internet. Get offline. Go outside. Let the sun shine on you. Let the rain fall on you. It's really the only real way to disconnect. Turn off the TV. Don't watch TV. Don't listen to the radio. Just turn on some tunes. And go live your life and breathe the air. Because I can guarantee you that air outside is just as good as it was 20 years ago. And I can guarantee you the water that you drink is just as good as it is was 20 years ago. And, and <laughs> people just be fucking real. Stop trying to be these other things that you're not. Um, not everybody can be a really rich comedian and make money telling stupid jokes. Not everybody can be the next, you know, can be a Leo Laporte and talk about technology and get paid for it. Which, you know, Leo Laporte, you know, he's not even really a tech dude. I mean, he, he knows some stuff, but he changes. He, he's more of an actor than he is, you know, a tech guy. Just like the newscast. The news newscasters, you know, the anchors. They're actors. They're not real. They're not genuine. Nothing on TV you see is real. The whole reality TV thing is not real. <laughs> so, 
Do your best not to be a hypocrite. Just be a good person. Don't be a dick. And never stick your finger where you wouldn't stick your face. See you tomorrow.